Today, the Portland Police Union posted a statement calling on leaders to do more to stop gang violence in Portland. Our Liz Birch talked with the man who was formerly incarcerated. Liz joins us live now. And Liz, uh, the man you spoke with says these retaliatory shootings are only going to get worse. Elizabeth and Dan, absolutely. For some perspective on this issue, I spoke to a man who tells me he was in federal prison for 15 years. He now refers to himself as being what he calls a gang veteran. Lionel Irving is the founder of the group Love is Stronger. It's a group focused on stopping this gun violence and keeping young men out of prison. He calls what's going on now inner community violence and says retaliatory shootings in Portland are continuing to get worse. You start having retaliation, it's like a brush fire. You create shooters. If I get shot today, one of my nephews or cousins that they didn't even think about shooting nobody has the potential to become a shooter now because he's sad, he don't know how to deal with the trauma he's just suffering from, and he's going to go out there and explode the only way he know how. He's calling on city leaders to come together to create a holistic approach to solving this gun violence. The Portland Police Association is also calling on our commissioners, although they have a slightly different message, saying in a statement, quote, City Council, do you hear gunfire in your neighborhoods? Where are your solutions? Victims and their families are waiting. Portlanders are waiting. Stop making excuses. Fix the problem. Our city deserves a response that meets the urgency of the situation. End quote. I did reach out to all of our city commissioners and have yet to hear back from any of them. So, of course, I'll keep you updated and tweet out those responses if I get them. Back to you. All right, Liz Birch, thank you.